Hi, this is Digital Bike Computing. We're going to look at how to change the time schedule or the time interval of your time machine backups. So by default, within your time machine area, right, which you'll see up here, is uh, it backs up every single hour by default. So if I have a look at my drop down here, it's going to back up, it backed up at 11.25, it's more than likely going to kick off again at 12.25. Uh, that seems like a cool feature, but it can fill up a lot more space. It makes your computer run a little bit slower every hour as it's indexing and backing up your data as well. So some people like to change it. I personally like to change the interval to a little bit longer, perhaps once every 12 hours uh, to do my backups. So the easiest way to do that, to do this, if you open up Safari, go into Google and look up Time Machine Editor. So the top option here, you want to download this program here, Time Machine Editor. It will do this automatically for you. Now, in previous versions of Mac OS, uh, there was another way to do it. You could go in and edit the what's called a plist file, which is like the Time Machine Editor file, uh, and you can go and manually change it within your library on your computer. Your Yosemite is a little bit smarter. It has a few little kinks, and what you find is that um, your time machine settings are overwritten from time to time. So by doing it this way, you're going to be sure that it's going to work. So let's download this program. It'll take a little while. All right, that's finished and let's open it up. All right, so what do we want to do? Mode of operation, when inactive, interval, calendar intervals. All right, so in our case, we're going to do calendar intervals because we want Time Machine to do backups at a certain time. All right, so you can also set up a few other things. So when inactive, Time Machine Editor will do its best to schedule backups when you are not actively using the machine. Hence, we don't want to be slowing down the computer. So it's going to do a backup if it just sees that it's in, uh, if it's in idle, right? If it's if it's idle. Interval, you can make it back up every hour. You can make it back up every twelve hours, every twenty hours, etc. Click on apply, and then it'll do that. Or you can do an actual calendar interval. We want it to back up daily at eleven fifteen p.m. We also want it to back up every month on the 10th of the month at 12.15 p.m. All right, apply. Time machine must be turned off. That's okay. It'll turn it off. Actually, it won't turn it off. You've got to turn it off manually. All right, so we just turn that off. Apply. You can ask for my password, which it's done. Time Machine will now use the new scheduling. And that's it. So now Time Machine will back up at those particular intervals. It's turned it on. You can manually turn it off by just dragging it to off and it will do the trick. So that is a great little feature, a great little program that lets you edit your Time Machine schedule. You can also customize your backups in a lot more, uh, in a lot smarter way, setting up daily, monthly, weekly backups, etc., which is really, really helpful. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And you can also visit my website at www.digitalbytecomputing for all the latest IT videos. Thanks for watching.